Well, good morning, RMA members. I, uh, I'm getting a sense of deja vu this morning. I don't know if anyone else is. So thank you very much for showing up very early in the morning for this important uh, election. And uh, I'm going to introduce myself again. My name's John Burroughs. I am a councillor for the County of Woodlands and I have been for the past uh, two terms. I served four years as Reeve and I'm in my uh, third year, I've done three years on the RMA board as the director for District 3 and it has been a fantastic honour to represent the members of District 3. Last night when I was uh, walking around, I don't think I'm a terribly well-known figure at RMA, but uh, I have done some, some fairly important work with RMA, and I'm beginning to see my fingerprints throughout our strategic plan and a lot of the uh, projects that we're doing and even siloing some of the projects so that we have uh, the opportunity to speak to ministers that may touch on edges of some of those, of those issues. Um, in, in having conversations with people last night, I saw some very passionate people about their community. I saw people that are interested in, in making a better place for their kids. And I, I was so impressed with the conversations that I had. Some, some of you I knew and some of you I didn't know. So thank you again for your support. And uh, I, I really appreciate the opportunity to, to stand before you today. So I, I want to just be really uh, touch on you know one thing in some of the work that we did with the RMA, and I'll I'll speak more with uh, with what uh, happened to our CAO uh, when the premier said that uh, oh gee you're going to have to get those uh, list of unpaid oil and gas taxes to a, I think he broke a filling. Uh, I, th I think he actually broke a filling. He, he gritted his teeth so hard because they do have that information and they get it regularly. So I, I just wanted to, uh, to make sure that, and, and that's again coming from my CAO. So yesterday I talked a little bit about being able to tell a story, and I think that that's important as well, but uh, the vice president's role is a little bit different. The, the role of vice president is one of being supportive of the president and being able to fill in when they're not available and represent the members well. And uh, Kara and I have worked together on the board for three years, and I think we've gelled in a, in a very good way. We can uh, move back and forth on the issues. We've sat together. Uh, we've developed relationships with ministers, with, with uh, the staff. And uh, I, I have to say, I'm, I'm just so proud of the work that the RMA is doing. Uh, you haven't seen one of the boards that I've been working on, which is the Wildfire Engagement Group. And that is going to be a, uh, a big piece when it's finally un un unveiled, but uh, I think you're going to see some really good, fantastic work again coming out of that project as well. So again, I, I'm just a, I'm very honored to be able to, to have the opportunity to represent you, and I hope that you will uh, support me. I, I do have the time to do the job, I have the relationships, I have the experience, and uh, I'm ready to hit the ground running to represent you in rural Alberta. So thank you very much.